hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to write a compute function for a field in odo 12 so for this purpose i have already created a new field here in the hospital.patient model which we are working on so here you can see i have added a new field like age group and it's a selection field with values major and minor what we have to go, we are going to do is that in this video we have to compute this age group based on the given age so the criteria is that if the age is greater than 18 the age group has to be set as major and if the age is less than uh, 18 that is if the age is 10 the age group has to be set by default as minor so let's see how we can done do it so if i go to the pycharm you can see in the python that is in the hospital.patient model i have defined new selection field with values as major and minor and here i am going to make it as compute fields for that I have to call a function for computing the values so i will give compute key equal to compute equal to set age group this is the function i'm going to define set age group then i will define a function with this name okay so here i will define the function with the name diff function name so i have defined a function as the field value is depends on this age so here we are going to uh, compute the whether the age is major or minor based on this patient age so i will give this in the depends here if i come here i will add an api decorator api depends age so this we are going to compute the uh, age group based on the patient age so i have given it in the depends then inside the function i will check whether the record cons contains the patient age if self dot patient age then if self dot patient age is less than 18 we put a space and less than 18 the record has to set self dot age group equal to self dot age group equal to minor else if the age is greater than 18 self dot age group equal to major so what we have done is defined here we called a compute function that is set age group and i defined the function here i also give it in, in the a, a patient age as depends because we are computing the age group based on the patient age then inside the function i have checked whether there is the record holds the value of the patient age so inside this uh, if age is less than 18 the age group is led to set to minor else the age group is set as major now i will restart the service and upgrade the module I'll upgrade the module okay the module is getting upgraded now if we go to the hospital form view we can see the changes we have done so here I will take the record of Ajay. You can see the age of Ajay is 25, which is above 18. So the age group is set to major. So I will change the age to uh, like 9. You can see once I, once I save this record, the age group will switch to minor. You can see the age group is changed to minor. If I say change it to an, another minor age itself, that is like 14, it will remain minor itself. And if I change it to uh, some age like 45, which is greater than 18, it will switch to major like this the value will compute get computed based on the age we have given here so this is how you can define a compute field now let us add the same field like we have only defined the age group inside the uh, form view also form view only if, if suppose if we add the same field inside the trivia also we will get an error message from from here so where is the so this is the age group field. I will copy this field and paste it here inside the tree view. Now if you restart the service, no, there is no need of restarting service as we make changes only inside the XML. I will just upgrade the module and if we come here, we will get an error message. I will explain the error message. So I am upgrading the module. Okay, the module get upgraded successfully and if i go to the hospital menu i will definitely get an error message and it will be singleton error okay 
that is because in Treeview we will have multiple records once we are in the uh, sale uh, form view we have only single record but in the tree view we will have self will hold multiple records like this so we have to iterate over the uh, self has to be iterated over the loop so i this i will add for rec in self and i will make the indentations correct and self will be replaced based on rec We, have to, we just iterate the self over a for loop. Now I will restart the service and update the module. Then we will not have this error. I will go to uh, apps menu, apps menu, and I will upgrade the module. I'll upgrade the module. So the module is getting upgraded here, and we will go to the hospital menu. Earlier, when we tried to access the hospital menu, it is getting error. Now we will go to the hospital menu. You can see there is no error. Also, the age group get added in the form view also. So this is how you can simply define a, a compute field. We just have to define a field. Just we define a field like age group and we call a compute function and uh, we have defined the function here. So if you have any queries regarding this, you can comment it out. We will reply you as soon as possible. If you have any uh, queries or more, if you need more tutorials in order development, you can directly ping us over the mail. The email ID is odomates at gmail.com. And please subscribe our YouTube channel for more updates regarding Odoo development tutorials. Thank you.